Mules and Jenny Towhead Track and Field Coach Chick Jandrin. Looking ahead to the Mules 2013-14 season, Coach, just give us your outlook for the Mules in the upcoming year. Well, it should be a fun year. Obviously, um, you know, winning the conference title the last few years in a row is something that we shoot for every year, and and that's a goal this year. Again, uh, I think it'll be very difficult for us to win a conference title, and we've kind of. Uh, road lob in Seattle the last few years, and we've scored a lot of points at the indoor conference meet, and now he's gone and uh, lost Brent Vogel, who set a national record indoors, and those kids are people you cannot replace. But, uh, you know, our cross-country team's having a great fall, and some of those kids are running very good, so hopefully a group of people collectively can step in and, and do what Lobbin did. We still have a, a fine group of young multi-eventers that are going to hopefully pick up the slack there and fill in. Uh, I do know we're going to be better on the track this year. We do have some better sprinters that are going to come in and do some good things. But at the same time, two of our best athletes had surgery over the summer. And whether they're able to return to their level from a year ago is very questionable. But uh, I do like our group. They're working very hard this fall. And uh, I think it's going to be a fun year for us. You know, what is it going to take for the Mules to kind of continue or try to continue that stretch of consecutive indoor conference championships this year? Well, it's really going to take a lot of our young kids stepping up, kids that maybe were not quite scoring in the conference meet last year or placing low in some events. They've got to step up and, and buy for conference titles. Um, it's always been a team effort for us. You know, last year we had one good thrower. This year we're going to rely on young throwers that need to step in and score for us. Um, you know, and once again, it's going to come down to being healthy. And if we can get all of our people healthy and on the same page and working hard, I think this can be another team that can possibly can contend for a conference title. You talk about losing Brent and Lobb and having young guys step up. Who are maybe a couple of those names that UCN fans should look out for coming into this year? Well, uh, obviously, Kellen Locke last year, who uh, won the indoor conference title in the 800 and then was third nationally outdoors, he really had a great year for us last year. Unfortunately, he's yet to run. He had surgery over the summer and uh, is still battling. and. Uh, um, not sure when he's going to start resume training, but his intention is to compete this year. Another one for us is Mayla Simpson, who was, uh, had a great indoor national meet where he scored high in two events, and uh, he also had surgery over the summer and is yet to really begin training again. If, if we can get those two back, they're going to do, do good things for us. Another one would be uh, Dan McCarty, and he's a young man who uh, led off our 4x4 at the national meet last year, and he's really a multi-eventer. If he can stay healthy, he's a guy that's going to surprise some people and do some things pretty quickly. So, uh, you know, and, and that's, that's just three kids that are young, and there's so many more out there that really just need to mature and step into the, to what they can do. All right. Thanks, Coach. Best of luck this year. Thank you.